What's up my Ponyos, Andy, Andy Vlogs, excited to share with you guys this content here. As the title suggests, we're going to be going over basically a portable power bank that you can use on the go. And what's nice as well is that it's got MagSafe compatibility. So those folks who have Qi charging on the back of their phone with magnets should be able to do it, especially the iPhone 12 series. We're going to go ahead and compare it as well with a similar product from a competitor called Anchor. With that said, I did want to let you guys know where my bias is. The folks at iWalk did send this product to me complimentary, so just know that I did get it for free. However, this is not a sponsored advertisement. Down below in the links in the description will be product availability and links that help out the channel to Amazon where you can purchase this product and this product. And if you like this case and are interested, you can check that case out as well. With that said, let's go ahead and uh, unbox this product and then do some light comparisons. So first and foremost, Anchor has a number of different solutions based on what you're looking for. Um, IWOC is providing you pretty an all-in-one solution that I think can cover a number of different power banks. So for instance, they actually have their own MagSafe power bank. It only has 4,000 milliamps and you know, in my opinion is a little too expensive and a little too small you know to cover all the needs that you need but just note that there are some uh, options here with anchor and you can check those out in the links in the description with that being said what we're going to be comparing is an anchor 13,000 milliamp batteries as opposed to a 20,000 milliamp battery with iowak that has a stand and is magsafe compatible so this isn't a very good option either because well this only serves one of the three options here that iWalk provides you. Without further ado, I've always liked iWalk's um, unboxing experience. They have this easy tape to peel off because as you know, I hate peeling tape off with a passion. They make it super easy. Props to you, iWalk. A couple things about this here is it's got, you know, a great magnetic strong connection. It's got a built-in stand and it also supports um, Qi charging for most iPhones and almost every uh, Android. So make sure and double check, see if you've got Qi charging on your phone. All right, with that said here, um, user guide application, it does come with the little dots to put on your phone if you wanna make it magnetized. It's got the instructions on how to use the stand. We'll just go ahead and show you here straightforward. All righty, so here it is. Uh, a little bit heavy, a little hefty, just right out of the box. Um, it's nicely wrapped in this, you know, plasticky filament kind of a thing. On the back of it comes with your charger, which is a USB type C, and then your applicators, uh, you know, for the different types of phones. This is the ac actual sticky thing that you put on there. And then the instruction guide. The marketing materials inside of the box uh, exclaim that it actually can go up to 15 watts depending on the device that you use from 5 all the way up to 15 depending on how you're charging it. So that's going to be depending on the MagSafe, whether you're using USB Type-C or some of the other ports here. But know that uh, that's pretty decent when it comes to charging bank. Here's a close-up shot of the device itself. You can tell that it's got kind of this Mac matte black feel and it, it, it is a little bit rough in order to kind of grip it you can see that the mag safe portion does protrude which um you know when we go into the testing part of this it, it might prove to be an issue because it's not going to lay flat on the side here is your button where you're going to be turning it on on the back is obviously the stand where you're going to be popping this off and it's going to be uh you know upright facing and whatnot we'll go over that as well on the front side here this is where you're going to be charging by usb type c and then it's got two different usb a ports for charging this little uh this little screen is your percentage on how much it's charged and then the button here to turn it on is right there all right uh, i'm gonna go ahead and test out now the magsafe because that's kind of what you guys are probably wanting to check out here first. So let's go ahead and uh, place it on the MagSafe. It does magnetize straight on and right off the bat, it shows us the MagSafe animation. I think that's fantastic. That's exactly what we're looking for. Now, now that it's uh, attached to it, I'm shaking it and it's not moving. So that's telling me that it's a very, very strong magnetic pull. Even though um, I'm using a case that is MagSafe, it's still able to, you know, attach to it pretty strongly. You can have it horizontal, vertical, whatever direction that you want. Um, I understand now why that they've got the gap because you've got this, uh, you've got this camera bump and that's not going to be preventing you from 
obviously connecting it to it. Let's go ahead and illustrate the stand itself. You've got these little notches that the backside is going to kind of clip to where you're going to get your different viewing angles. You've got about a 45 degree angle and then now you've got I don't know what kind of angle that is. That's going to be closer to like 65 or 70, uh, depending on how you want it angled. Let's go ahead and show you what that looks like horizontally as well. That's a pretty, pretty straightforward, I think, in my opinion, pretty good, pretty straightforward build. All right, just giving you a kind of a visual or physical uh, comparison here with uh, the anchor. Anchor's got this Smart IQ, which is up to 15 or 18 watt charging, depending on which port and type that you're using. Uh, you can tell that it's about, I don't know, 40% bigger. It's probably 10% wider. Uh, it's about the same width. Um, so, and, and then the weight, I'd say it's about twice as heavy. But that's because you're getting a 20,000 milliamp battery as opposed to a 13. Uh, I'm not going to go over efficiencies. I'm not going to go over charge times. I don't think that's really necessary. But if you're traveling and you need, you know, a charge for a couple of days and you're not going to have, honestly, like a plug to be able to charge it to, this is this is a great bet. If you want something on your desk, if you want to be able to charge other products as well as your phone, this is definitely going to be the right product for you. All right. I wanted to lastly illustrate that this can charge your MacBook Pro in a pinch when you need it. I've gone ahead and uh, turned on the battery. You can now hear, you probably didn't hear it, but my MacBook Pro just give, gave the sound that it's being charged. In addition to that, let's go ahead and put the, uh, the iPhone on top of it and show you that it can be charging simultaneously with the battery as well. See that? The MagSafe animation didn't show up, so that, that tells me that it might be um, having some smart charging where it's putting less output to the phone and more, honestly, through the USB. Um, but I mean, that's an option. You can charge up to three devices. I think that's pretty awesome. Well, Pungios, uh, that about does it. I think this is fantastic. You can literally charge three devices at once. My phone wirelessly charge your earbuds and plug into your MacBook Pro, MacBook Air and charge it all, all simultaneously. This is a fantastic product. It can be used as a desk um, stand, you can get landscape on your phone. You can get, or, you know, portrait mode. I just think it's a really good product. I wouldn't, uh, you know, go ahead and make a video for you guys. If it wasn't a good product that I use and will use. Um, so if you guys are interested in this product, check down below in the links in the description. Just know that this was provided to me complimentary. Um, nonetheless, uh, it is a very good product. I'm happy to be able to share this with you. If you like this content, guys, hit that like button. Subscribe if you want to see more. My name is Andy with Andy Vlog Setting Out.